hello everybody in this video we are going to learn about dictionaries dictionaries are unique to lists because they are associated by key value pair a dictionary we associate objects with or values with a key value pair so for understanding uh, the dictionaries concept we have added two scripts here item and item DB and I have attached this item DB with a camera game object you can add to any other object as well so here uh, we will come to item uh, script and we we can delete this mono behavior and we will create a class public class item and we can name this item uh, we, we can assign two variables to this item one will be string and uh, we can name it string and the another variable we can assign is integer id okay so now in traditional way we can access this uh, item class here in item db and if we create a list here for example public list and then uh, we name the list as item and we will name this list to database and then definitely we will create a new list item so in this way we have accessed our items and now if we go to editor you will see on camera there is a there will be a field of uh, items here so sorry databases are here so we will save this script I think I didn't saved maybe so this one as well and then we will move to our unity and it's taking some time I think item db script everything is fine so let's play and again we will check oh okay because we didn't have added serializable so we will add here system dot serializable So now hopefully it will be visible in side unity so now you can see there is a database with the size 0 so we we can make any size and here you can see that we have elements now and each element has a name and ID so in this way we can add lists so if for example we want to uh, filter any of these list items we can use for each loop for each element okay uh, but dictionaries are quite different in dictionaries the each item is associated with a key okay so with that key we can uh, uh, instantiate that specific item so let's create a dictionary so we, we will uh, learn that how dictionaries will work so just like uh, lists we can create a new dictionaries as well so here for creating the dictionaries we will add public dictionaries okay and dictionary is also a default uh, uh, it's getting this keyword from collections dot generic library so no need for including any other library so here we will say list sorry here we will assign int okay so for example I, I, I will write here dictionary you will see when we select dictionaries you can see a t key and t value so we can add a key 
and we can add a value for dictionary so what we will do here we will assign integer for a key and for a value we will assign directly item okay so in this way we can add dictionary now we will assign a name to this dictionary so we will say item dictionary for example dictionary and just like a list we, we, we can create a new and then we will say dictionary and here we will say int and item and we will close the function okay so now we have created this dictionary but there is a certain difference between dictionaries and lists dictionaries are not uh, in default visible inside editor so for showing the dictionaries inside editor we have to program something so first we will create a list here okay so we will say public list and uh, similarly item and we can name it items or any other name you can assign and then we will say new list item okay so we have uh, added a list so now in start function if for example we want to show the dictionary we will say item dictionary dot now we get some functions here just like list we can add something we can clear something or any other thing we can do so here we, we will add okay and here we can assign a name and ID so for example we want to display ID 0 comma and then we can name our uh, value okay so the value for example we didn't have created any values so for example we have a item uh, name uh, for example bike okay so we have a bike item so now we have to add this bike item so before adding the bike so for bike item we will uh, select item and here we will say bike and we will say equal to new item okay just like creating list items so here we will say bike dot name equal to and we will say bike and bike dot id we can assign the id to zero for example okay so now this bike uh, item is in instantiated and uh, here we will say we want to add this bike to list as well so uh, here we will say item dot sorry item list item where is item list item list we didn't create it item lists so yeah actually uh, yes actually we have named it items sorry items dot add and then we will say bike okay so in this way we have added a list uh, item bike as well so then in the last what we will do we will 
say variable item equal to and here we will say item dictionary and just like arrays we will make these and the in these brackets you can see now we have int and item okay and we will get int key so if we place this now we can add int int key uh, the key value okay so here we will place zero so so that's nice we have added a uh, dictionary and here now uh, afterward we can add any time uh, we can select item dot id or item dot name okay so that's it for the basic understanding of dictionaries in next video we will uh, learn about looping dictionaries